Yeehaw, baby! What's going on, YouTube? My name is Diesel, and today we are back in Scrap Mechanic, an awesome, brand new little game that is coming out tomorrow, and we're getting hyped for it because the hype train is real. It's so much fun to try and build and create stuff. It is also very frustrating, but you know what? We can deal with it. We can do our best with it. And Diesel, what we got going on over here? Well, let me I'll show you. Alright. So, I was uh, chilling out with the lady last night and, uh, you know, doing, doing uh, you know, manly type stuff. Uh, but then, what we, uh, I was thinking, uh, I think I was watching like the History Channel or something was going on or something where there was a rail, like a rocket rail, rocket rail, rocket rail, like Rocket League, but rocket rail. And I was like, that would be kind of cool to go back and forth whenever like survival kicks in. Whenever that game mode comes into play, there's going to be robots all over the place. There's going to be baddies. There's going to be things that could, they're trying to hurt you. And you don't want to, you know, walk through all that. So, what I have here is one, two, three, four, eight tires uh, all in a row. It's pretty fancy. Yes, and uh, each engine, let's see here. Uh, one engine connects to the bottom four and another engine connects to the top four which provides the rail as far as the power goes. You don't want to give it too much power because then it goes crazy and it doesn't align right. And uh, to be honest with you, it gets you where you need to go. It gets you from point A to point B and back again. So I think this would be pretty cool in a survival area to like just go from one, from one area to another. And I thought that would be kind of cool. But at the same time, I'm like, it is kind of wonky, you know, like it just doesn't run correctly. Sometimes you really got to take it slow. Otherwise, it just bang, bang, bangs all up and down. And I think it has to do with the fact that there's nothing underneath it. No tires underneath it. So I was like, well, if we're going to do something underneath it, we might as well make. Let's see here. Come here. Boom. We might as well make a gondola. What's that? A gondola. And I got controllers here for doors. What's up? This is a really cool aspect that's really going to make my mind blow up crazy. Uh, the controller are awesome. Uh, controller, then you have the button that goes to control the controller. There's a little pivot point right here. And if you go over into the controller, you can make sure you go 90 degree angle, 90 degree angle. It's going to take some uh, hit or miss. It is, it is. It's really going to take a lot of testing and a lot of time. But I can't wait to get into some like doors and all kinds of fun stuff. Because this is what happens when you hit the button. Whoa. <laughs> Knocked me out. Yes, I would, I would like to enter the gondola. I would. Now, I made a mistake before, I, this is the second version of this, because I was just making like a covered gondola. The only problem is, is that if you try to exit out of this, with and you don't give yourself enough clearance, enough headroom, it will actually not, it knocks this off the rails. So I was like, why, why, why is it doing that? What, 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 what happened? So, I was like, alright. So redesign, rebuild, all we have to do basically for this to get those things onto the rails to begin with is pretty, uh, it's pretty easy to get this. I started out just with the top jaw, just with the board at the top, which has, it's just like that. It just has the two wheels in the center. It is, nine, it is 18, 19 long. It's 19 long, uh, so that way you have a nice little center point. Right there, and plus you can add all kinds of, you maybe add some decorations or something like that. Something to make it all purdy. Kind of like what I have done here. Uh, these wires are completely aesthetic. Uh, everything does not connect to anything. Just looks kind of nifty. You know? And as far as the engines, there are four engines because we have uh, 12 tires. Four, two in the back, up top, two in the front, up top. And we have two on the sides, two on the bottom. So we have all of the railing covered uh, and it's pretty awesome so um, let's go ahead and we'll, let's, let's give it a test drive here let's do it let's, thought I heard a noise I'm like they didn't add things to this game while I was asleep of course not I whip my head back and forth oh, my head gets go crazy here that's funny see whoa see now uh, I made the, uh, the mistake that if you go to exit out of this bad boy and then your head peeks through the ceiling and then it actually literally knocks this off and you can't just pick this up with your uh, your lift and then place it back up it will not let you so once this is on there it's on there for good 
Hopefully. I mean, if you if, it, if this falls off, forget about it. Just scrap it. You gotta figure out how to do it again. All over again. Now, the engines are only at a level 2, level 3, because we just need to smoothly go along. And look at this. Now, the bottom tires aren't spinning all that uh, fantastic, but you know what? We don't need them to spin all that fantastic. Oh, God. But this is pretty cool, baby. So now, instead of going through all the mobs and all the robots and all the things and whatnot, so you can set up your own little like little uh, little stations and even conveyor belts too to go along. And when you're building your factories or what uh, what whatever you're planning on doing, which will have the diesels mechanic shop, we'll have all kinds of conveyor belts and things to go underneath the hoods of all of our vehicles. It'll be a lot of fun. But yeah. And, all, and since you don't have to worry about steering or anything like that, you're not going left or right. It's just basically just rocking the engines and make sure you put the controller in the center. Otherwise, it's just going to take off and then you'll never see it again. So you could lay out infinite amounts of tracks and have infinite amount of stations between your bases and other people's bases if you're playing on multiplayer. If you guys have uh, friendlies, you know. I'm not sure what the PvP is going to be looking like on this genre, but I think it's all merely creative. Really creative builds. And we're all going up against robots, something. I'm not really sure, but I can't wait. So, this is the gondola. It's, you know, fairly simple, but it's just, it's just getting, it's just getting all that stuff hooked up and then realizing and testing it out. This is actually the second time I wrote it, because I just want to make sure that those tires uh, spin. And there's only one wooden block with one little spinner, one little bearing in there. Uh, they're all pointing, you got to make sure when you're doing this because the tires are going to go that way but then on this side the tires are going to go that way because nothing they're not going to be going the same zone they're not going to be going the same areas and of course this platform the platform here is all pretty cool i like these stairs too this is the you know just the stair area like right here we put a railing i want to put a railing i want to put a railing let's do a railing Woo. Uh. Uh. Oh. Huh? There we go. There we are. Okay. So we'll just do this. Go up. Up. Very good. Very good. Boom. 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 In case we have any workers, we don't want to get sued for not having railings, you know? You know what I mean? It can happen and has happened. Staircase long railing. Hmm. Let's go ahead and let's make this go all the way around. What do you say? Okay. Let's check it out. Check it out. What the hell? What's going on? Oh, there we go. Alright. Boom. 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 Salute you. Boom. What about short railing? Do we have short railing? Short eye beams? Nope. 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 Oh, staircase short railing. Let's see what that does. Perfecto. Perfecto, my friend, my friend. Uh, let's see here. Staircase railing join. Hmm. Is this is where you're supposed to join all these things? Is it now? Is it now? Really? I guess. Okay. All right, okay, all right, okay, come on now. Oh, staircase bolster, we'll have to put that on here. Very nice, very good. And I'm off. Of course you're off, Diesel, you're a crazy person. Try on error with that, uh, let's see. <laughs> it's like, my bad. Uh, uh, get my Minecraft, can we do it? Boom, nice, nice. Although it will not even up. Will it? No, it won't. Boo. So it takes some finagling. It takes some what uh it takes some uh good old fashioned figuring out. That's the scientific term for trying to get all your stuff together. Yeah, we can do that. You can even do uh, stuff like in between. You can put little blocks in between to uh make everything look pretty. If you're someone like me who just likes to make things pretty. Uh, yes, there we go. There we go, my friend. Yeah, so, alright. And then, to, you know, if you want to hide this, we can hide it. Uh, uh.
Uh, uh. Awesome. Awesome. I'll tell you what, we can even get rid of this little area right here. Okay. And then we have the staircase landing. A staircase landing. And then we'll take this. Aha. Then that doesn't extend as far. Unless we extend it out further. Hmm. Let's see here. Go ahead. Hey, 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 hey. Let's go. Come here. There we go. No, wrong. 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 It's wrong. It's all wrong. There we go. And then we'll do the joiner. Joiner cursey. Jackie joiner cursey. A shelf. So we'll have to start making that. I think uh, and, uh, we're going to do another episode later on today. And uh, we're going to build ourselves a little area for us to sit and kind of just uh, chill. Hang out. Chill out. Max and relax and all cool. While we're shooting some people outside of my school with a couple of guys, they were up to no good. Started making trouble in my neighborhood. Let's do this for. Whoop. Ha ha. Aha. Boom, boom, boom. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Can we do this? Oh! Oh, my skills. My skills. I got skills to pay the bills. And then we'll take you. We'll take you. No, that's wrong. There we go. There we go, yes. Do the short. No. Don't. Come on. There we go. Yeah, it's nice. That's all kinds of nice now for everyone involved. Alright, so go ahead and put this down. To the ground. Ba -ba -da -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum 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 boom. Boom. Nice. So, now in order to stacks Montana it up, let's go ahead and... Boom. Boom. Very cool. I like it. I like it a lot. Now let's make a little border here. Whoa, whoa, sport. Where are you going? Where are you going there, guy? All right. So let's nice and even up there for you. Hmm. <clears throat> hmm. That'll be fine for now. We all get the gist of it. We give it a little border here. Yeah, we've hidden from the underground, from the outside, but just gives you an aspect of what you can build and construct here in Scrap Mechanic. And believe me, this is an alpha, and there's so, I think that there is so much upside to this game, and just adding different blocks and de different decorative things and mechanical things, adding in, uh, you can make like your own homemade pistons. Um, I was watching some Zul'jin today, and he's got a piston. Doesn't work all that hot, but you know what? It's all about the effort. You know, let's give them E for effort. The pistons, like, to try and move walls and stuff like that, uh, it's a little wonky. But, I mean, with the controllers here, you can have a, a whole crap ton of options and connect them all up. And make yourself a nice door or elevator. Elevator? Yeah, elevator. Uh, which is pretty fly. But I like my little door. So, folks, that's our episode. If you enjoyed this episode, go ahead, hit like. Oh, hold on a second. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, let's hop in here. Whoa, my head is going crazy. So if you enjoyed this episode, go ahead, hit like. It helps my channel out ever so much more than you know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos are coming out every single, <laughs> every single day, every single week. Folks, have a great day, afternoon, evening, good night. Peace out like shout chow, and I will check you out right here again in Scrap Mechanic next time. Back her up, back her up, beep, beep, beep.